Hey what's up people glad to join you here and welcome back to my Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon Let's Play today we're going to be exploring Paniola Town but before we do that don't forget to answer today's question of the day yes with that said let's get this episode rolling yeah so last episode we got Ash's Pikachu yeah so that was really fun uh, Snowball Milk Tank oh what's going on oh it's how Hey Luna, glad I ran into you. Why? So we can see who's stronger now, of course. I got a sea power ring for my Grams too, after making it through his grand trial. So he made it, huh? Having a battle in a place like Paniola Town feels like we're in a real old-fashioned western showdown or something, right? This is so cool. Though, if we're real honorable cowboys, we gotta make sure our teams are healthy first. You know, I could always use the experience points. Alright team, Toroka and Pikachu and everybody. You ought to all be bursting with energy after eating a pile of my mom's special pancakes. So let's show this newbie what Alola's got. This guy just called me a newbie. Alright. Alright, let's show him what the people of Kanto can do. <laughs> oh, Torokat. Okay, if it's Torokat... Um, I'm going to use a Brion, of course, but, you know, I want to get as many experience points as I can. And I'm pretty sure I got some Roto boosts for... Oh, maybe I don't. That sucks. Ah. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't have them. I thought I did. You know, for extra experience points. Oh well, no big deal. Let's use water gun. Eh, I'm not faster. Eh, please don't paralyze me. Yes. Eh, will it be enough? It is. Oh my. I hope he has some flying type or water type Pokemon. Yeah, so I can use my Pikachu. I oh, so yeah, level 23 for Brion. And Rock Ruff grew to level 19. So yeah, Rock Ruff can start evolving at level 25, I believe, yes. Between 5 p.m. and 5.59 p.m. He's going to use Pikachu now. And what do I got for Pikachu? Ah, uh, let's go with Growlithe. You know, I don't really use my Growlithe that often. Oh, well, you might as well. Hopefully she can handle it. Level 17 versus level 15. And my mess, my best move. Ember. Yes, because uh, this Growlithe is a... What do you call it? Bold nature? Damn it. Let's keep trying though. It only takes three. Eh! Ah, burned! And now let's finish it off with Amber. Electro Ball. Oh crap. Yeah, I didn't want to use a physical attack because I know this Pikachu has the ability static and I don't want to get paralyzed. <laughs> Noibat. Ooh, okay. Rock Ruff? Yes, let's go with Rock Ruff and use Rock Throw. Yeah, my Rock Ruff is. Jolly Nature, yes. And now, rock throw. I'm not faster. I'm oh, I am faster. Okay. And yes, one hit KO. Rowlet grew to level 18. And EB. Yeah, let's use Pikachu.
and I can use 10 million bolt thunderbolt. Oh, ah, come on. <laughs> yes, one hit KO again. Yeah, my Pokemon are pretty weak defensively. So I'm thinking I should get a new Pokemon later down the line. And I'll probably get rid of either <laughs> Baniri. <laughs> How should like that, how? Man, and, and that was some kind of battle. Torka and everybody all look like they had a blast too. Here, I'll share my bit of good luck with you, Luna. Dire hit. You know how the total Pokemon are all like surrounded by some aura of power? If you use a dire hit on your Pokemon and manage to land a critical hit, that aura won't mean a thing. You might want to try using some of those Rotom powers when you're fighting a totem too. You know, Pokemon battles are just like sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. But you're only a really a loser if you don't have any fun while you're at it, right? Nah, that's loser talk. You know, you're in it to win it, right? <laughs> anyway, I'm heading off to Pandora Ranch. Alright, take it easy, I suppose. That was fun. Uh, this episode's yeah, it's gonna be really short. I just need to find all the items and talk to everyone, of course. Let me go inside the Pokemon Center. To we get by because we share our work with our Pokemon and they deign to help us with it. Let's buy some coffee from this guy just so we can get some Poke Beans. Yeah, Gomala Coffee. Oh, I forgot I'm broke. Yeah, I shouldn't have been buying stuff. <laughs> Alright, sir, hurry up. The Rage Candy Bar. Yes. That's what I wanted. Huh, that was fun. Um, you know how sometimes you seem to be alone, but you feel like someone's watching you? Do you think that's the Guardian watching? Nah, it's probably something else. <laughs> we'll do so. Pokeballs, Poke Toys Repels, Escape Ropes. You know, the typical stuff. What about you? Any TMs, perhaps? Oh, no. Okay, um, let's go outside now. No, 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 no. You gotta love the music. So, up, kid? What are you doing? If you click here, I was child, you can ride on the back of a real Charizard. You can actually fly through the sky. What's going on here? Yo, yo, Bobux, give me that bottle cap. No. <laughs> Please stop. What's going on here? What you looking at? What's this Pokemon need a nice bottle cap for? I'm just gonna put it to better use, that's all. Oh, okay. Wait, wait a second, what? You there, do you think it helped? It could. 
I really care. I'll be back in a sec, though. I need to find some items around here. A revive. And a totem sticker. Hundred ten pounds. Okay. Yeah, if you interact with this milk tank, you'll get a moo moo milk. It's daily, so yeah, come back again tomorrow. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so where were we? Oh yeah, I was gonna battle this some fools. <laughs> you want a piece of me? I'll show you what happens when you mess with Team Skull. Alright, show me what you got. Homie. <laughs> Rata, and of course, we're going to use this Starving Voice. And good thing I didn't use Quick Attack. Because I don't want to take any damage. I don't want this battle to take any longer than it needs to. You got a piece of me, and I guess I shouldn't have messed with you. But that's how we learn. That's how we learn. <laughs> Alright, beat it. It's all your fault just because you wouldn't hand over that bottle cap. I said to beat it. Yo, you got lucky, Bullpix. Don't count on people to help you next time. That's right, you better run away. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. You okay, Bullpix? It's leaving. Oh dear, what's wrong? You tell me. I thought it was your Bullpix. Isn't it? Yeah, uh, so eventually you can get the bottle cap, but maybe you gotta come back tomorrow? If I remember, I'll do it, but I probably won't. <laughs> okay. This is Kiawe's house. Uh, what's going on over here? And totem sticker. Just two out of three for Paniola Town. And there should be another one upstairs. Um, if I remember correctly. Uh, one of these magmars gives you an item. I think it's this one. Yeah, a quick ball. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, here's the totem sticker. So that's three. For now. 100 volcanic beasts of the world and chooses volcanoes from various regions. Recently, Mount Chimney and Reverse Mountain have been popular. Anything else here? It's Kiawe's bed. I mean, who the hell is Kiawe? He's one of the trial captains. Yeah, it smells like sweat. Uh, disgusting. Let's get out of here. <laughs> and I believe that's all for this episode. Yeah, uh, next episode we'll explore Paniola Ranch. Yes, it should be another fun episode. And after that, uh, Route 5. And then Captain Lana's trial. Yes. Uh, I didn't talk to these people here. Let's see anything, anything interesting? Perhaps you'll give me an item? <laughs> nope. Okay, guys, so uh, uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to you know, answer the question of the day. And also, feel free to smash that like button and subscribe as well. You know, that's always appreciated. 
But other than that, uh, thanks for watching, and I guess I'll catch you next time.